TV. Today is the 20 of February at 2023. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that you do upload here. So guys, uh, Lepopo Health MEC Popi Ramatuba has been reprimanded by the Health Professions Council of South Africa, HPCSA, for shouting at a Zimbabwean patient in the Limpopo Provincial Hospital in August last year. Ramatuba was cited for unprofessional conduct and unbecoming behavior. Though Ramatuba was at the hospital in her capacity as a health MEC and not a practicing doctor, she is a medical doctor by profession. The FF Buyuseni Ndozi, in his capacity as the party's Limpopo Provincial Conveyor, laid a complaint with the HP CSA against Ramatuba, accusing her of violating the dignity and human rights of the patient. This follows a disturbing video clip which is circulating on social media where she is seen belittling and abusing a Zimbabwean patient in Bella Bella Hospital, said Nlozi. It is evident on the video that MEC Ramatuba has violated her core ethical values and standards for good practices as outlined by Health Professionals Council of South Africa. He said and quoted the council's set standards for health care practitioners. This includes respect for people. Health care practitioners should respect patients as people and acknowledge their worth, dignity and sense of value. They also call on health care practitioners not to harm or act against the best interest of patients even when the interest of, of the latter conflict with their own self-interest. The standards require healthcare pr practitioners to recognize the human rights of all individuals and to be sensitive to and emphasize with the individual and social needs of their patients and seek to create mechanisms for providing comfort and support where appropriate and possible. There's no doubt that the MEC has violated all the above mentioned ethical values and standards. It is for this reason that the FF calls upon the HP. CSA to investigate her conduct and appropriate action to uh, be taken against her, said Nlozi. In a video on social media, Ramatuba could be heard telling the patient that migrants were to blame for her department's stretched budget. He was sparked a debate in the country with some in support where others thought she was unfair on the patient. The HPCSA First Medical and Detail Committee resolved last month that there was evidence of unprofessional conduct on Ramatuba in terms of the regulations under the Health Professions Act. In a report dated February 9, the council said it would impose a penalty, caution and reprimand Ramatuba for unprofessional behavior and becoming conduct of a medical profession to be shouting at a patient's bedside as the patient was vulnerable at the time. Ramatuba spokesperson Tilly Valley Moava was not available for comment. So guys, that's the latest, that's the latest here. This video did train last year uh, in, in August uh, 2022. We talked a lot about it here on this channel so many times. So the EFF um, Lozi, yes, um, were you saying Lozi? Capacity as the party's Limpopo Provincial Conveyor laid a complaint with the HP CSA against Ramatuba, accusing her of violating the dignity and human rights uh, of the patient at that time. And so, Marisosa Sobuda this year, she is when I was at the show, it was an ethical for her to do what she did. Kudem Zimbabwe, we are Akarapwa, and that hospital, I am Obude, was not Badara. And you guys, uh, illegal immigrants, um, Ruku Kanganisa budget, I took poor and remained, Maruku Paku remained, the Mukanganisa Mimi, and it was a Tugura pie for free, and Zimbabwe should pay. Uh, for your medical bills because once my discharge will my disappear and most of the addresses that you guys are giving us here I don't got to falls I'm not my permanent addresses here it's that people are even traveling from Zimbabwe to South Africa to seek medical attention even the present Aramaposa Pakato Zoyenda uh my hospital is here I should see Gira so Katawa na MEC Aramatuba nothing wrong about what she said Panaya health care of illegal immigrants and so the story could still continue though because in most uh, hospitals in South Africa, yes, if you are a illegal immigrant, you should marry up front. Otherwise, if they treat you, you should marry. 
wasati wako discharge kuti bude much patare momo and saka mari ya kutodi up front some hospitals they don't even treat illegal immigrant saka wajinchi wakanda kuma private hospitals and saka since then zunjata wako chinja even uh, today things are changing very quick even after june uh, 30 ma permits ma jinji pananga expire ema zimbabwe na zipen permits ukona sija kare kuti ashipata uh, zvakawanda vanenge vachitora mba ku twitter ma zimbabwe nzi vanenge vasina ma documents akakwana and uh, so this is a daily news breaking news everyday news on prince minandetsini tv remember guys to like share comment and follow please